Welcome, friends. I am so happy to see all of you here. You have done a great job in working to fulfill my dream. This was my dream that when great master predicted that the axis of spirituality will move to the west and settle in the United States in a big way, that was long time back. He said this in 1937. and he wrote letters in the same year to some of his american disciples you are all ready somebody has to come to explain to you in your way in your language and you will be some of the greatest achievers of sant math principles you will be able to go to your true home for a long time spirituality in its highest form has existed in the east mostly china and india it moved to the middle east for a while and stayed in these two areas for a long time a time has come when the axis itself has shifted and therefore this is a great place where great spiritual events will take place this is the site where great masters will appear and they will be able to help the people the seekers of the ultimate truth It's a wonderful experience for me to see you all participating in something that has a long future right here at this site. This is su such a beautiful experience for me that I cannot thank you enough for fully fulfilling my dream. I am happy that you could all come here on the site in such large numbers and all participating in seva, mitti seva. we call it bitti seva bitti means dirt means d mud dirt it is an old tradition in the dera in india from great masters time to do mitti seva it has many values apart from the fact that it is a seva by itself seva for the master that's itself a big thing the second thing is that when we do mitti seva we are all covered in the bitti Yeah, all covered with dust, and the distinction between one and the other is lost. We all look like very funny human beings. <laughs> Nobody knows who is who. Old friends can recognize each other, but I recall how one American disciple had gone to the to the Dera once, and when he arrived there. he was told that he has a reservation in the guest house in the dera in india so he saw people working with dirt carrying baskets of dirt carrying other thing bricks so he called one of the guys he said hey can you come here and help me take my suitcase to my guest house the man came running he said certainly sir the american said i'm glad you speak english he said yes i do speak english may not be as good as yours but i'll certainly help you take your suitcase so he carried the suitcase and this american disciple is saying poor fellow such a poor guy uh, but anyway i'll give him a good tip very takes me i have taken him off from the work he was doing I don't know what he was getting paid for this labor he was doing, poor fellow. But I'll give him a good tip. So when they reached the suitcase, that American disciple took out a one-dollar bill, and he said, "I am giving you this American money. It's worth a lot more, several times more than your Indian currency. I'm giving you good tip for the good work you have done." And the man said, "Sorry, sir, I don't take any tips. I did this out of seva for you." so i always do seva i don't do it out of uh, to get any money out of it he said no 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 it's a good tip we always do that in america we give good tip for good service you brought my suitcase brought me to the guest house he take this dollar the man said folded his hand please forgive me now i don't take tip there was a meeting with the master in the evening where a few people had gathered including this gentleman from united states and he saw a man suited in a nice suit sitting in 
the front row where he was seated, he looked around. He said, that looks like the same man that I asked to carry the suitcase. So he asked the man next to him, he said, who's that guy? He says, he's a billionaire, a big industrialist who runs so many companies. <laughs> <laughs> Mitty Seva made everybody equal. What is the advantage? That's a hit on our ego. And we need some hits on our ego. You know all know that. So therefore, it's a great way to come to this kind of opportunity to do seva. I'm very happy you all came and joined here. I wish you all success. And I hope to see you again soon. So with my brief comments, I will wish you Godspeed. And good luck in your work when you complete this. When this dome is completed. This Isha Conference Center, that day I will come and dedicate it to my Master Baba Savan Singh and call it Dera Baba Savan Singh. Thank you very much.